joining us now and uh, February. Start of February looking so good. Maybe a trip yeah. to the beach might be in order. <laughs> He's seen the seven day forecast. A long hooky weekend. Yeah, you better yeah, believe it. If you haven't seen the seven day forecast, you're going to want to stick around for sure because it has some warm air in it. It also has February in it. Can't get here fast enough. All right, take a look at Myrtle Beach where you can see gorgeous day along the coastline. Lots of sunshine from the beaches all the way to the mountains. Now we are looking at some pretty comfortable conditions for late January. Clear skies out there. You can see the coast is clear. So are the mountains. We're going to see that changing though tomorrow as some clouds kind of sneak in here. Our temperatures right now are warmest the farther south and east you go. So Myrtle is at 43. Right now we've got 40 in Columbia and 42 in Charlotte. We've got numbers in the 30s across the triad. Northern Piedmont cool at 31 in Reedsville, 33 in Martinsville, 30 in Galax and temperatures in the upper 30s in the triad. Now tomorrow morning we'll be in the mid to upper 20s for the mountains and foothills and close to 30 degrees in the triad. So everybody's freezing in the morning. Then we've got moisture that we're going to keep a close eye on. There's plenty of rain out here. There's also a little snow there from Kansas City southwest into the Plain States. Now the hour by hour forecast shows you just a few patchy thin clouds in the morning, but those clouds get a lot thicker, especially by lunchtime and into the afternoon, capping our temperatures off in the upper 40s, close to 50. By tomorrow evening, we're starting to see at least a little light rain moving into the mountains, and yes, even a few snowflakes mixing in. Right now, no winter weather advisory has been issued for the mountains, but I suspect that we'll be doing that as we go into tomorrow because there could be some light amounts of snow, some of those high elevations for sure tomorrow night into early Thursday. Here's the triad forecast for tomorrow. It does have that chance of rain late. Otherwise, it's a dry day with numbers that are in the upper 40s by late afternoon. Foothills with a light breeze tomorrow, partly sunny skies. High temperature is 47 and then the temperatures in the mountains get into the low 40s by tomorrow afternoon. We also add that rain chance as it gets dark. Yes, this is the storm system that's headed our way. You can see it over Texas, Louisiana and Arkansas. It's a rainmaker. It has limited moisture though for us, meaning most of this precipitation is going to stay south over Georgia, over South Carolina. The northern extent of it will push into our area. So you're going to notice on this map tomorrow evening that you do have some showers and some snow in the mountains, but the bulk of the rain is down there from Wilmington to Myrtle Beach to Charleston and really pretty much stays there. So we've got patchy light rain in the forecast for our area overnight into morning. And again, the possibility of some snow in the mountains and that overnight, by the way, is not tonight, but tomorrow night. And then we're going to turn our attention to our next weather system. This is our Friday Saturday storm. It's going to take a southerly track too, but it has a better chance of bringing at least some more measurable rain into the triad as well as a chance of snow. So for the triad Wednesday night into Thursday morning, a small rain chance. Rain does arrive Friday. It's cool. It's a little bit warmer Saturday. Saturday, as that rain is moving out pretty early on Saturday for the mountains. We've got rain and snow showers tomorrow night into Thursday morning with some light amounts. Then we've got another rain snow chance Friday night and then some snow early Saturday, but it warms up enough that that's kind of a rainy snowy mix. As for snow, everybody wants to hear about snow this time of year, right? It looks like our best chances for measurable snow are in the areas that climatologically favor snow this time of year, and that is in the mountains. There is your seven day forecast and there are your 60s. Early February starts off mild.